The University of Idaho, through its professors and programs, will open up people's minds. I think we expose students, graduate students, undergraduates, and frankly faculty as well, to different ideas coming from all different sorts of places. And that's where I think a college education is all about, is open to different ideas. You don't have to agree, but you can at least hear them out and see what's there. We don't just give recipes and say, you do this the rest of your life this way. Because as we know, ideas change. They change rapidly over time. Some things in horticulture have changed, some are the same. But we give the students ideas to think about. So again, that's where I say the students, graduate students and undergraduate, give a program energy. They try some things because they don't maybe don't know any better that uh, are actually very helpful and useful. Also, undergraduates, when they work in my lab, uh, or any labs, uh, yeah, they do get some unique experiences that, that uh, students who aren't working in, in programs will not get. So one of the things, in my opinion, that they get that's important is they get to see some insights. So when they have some of these classes, whether it's mine or other classes, they can ask some intelligent questions because they've seen some things that other students won't see if they're not working in the laboratory. So it helps that way. Some of the times they learn the most but they don't like it is when we when I give them a project which is very difficult. That being, for instance, try to get to the meristem on a plant. Very difficult. You need microscopes, you need uh, scalpels and what we call dissecting probes. <clears throat> and those probes, it's like you're working with a big machete trying to take off a, a little tip of a pen. Like imagine a tip of a ballpoint pen using a machete to do that. Very difficult. So. It's hard to do, students don't like it when they do it, but they really do get a lot out of it and they can see some tangible results. Well, that's when they're most engaged when they're learning something new. When it's presented in a way that, that just seems so routine, I think you lose them. And that's where the clubs come in for critical thinking, for leadership, uh, both of those. We can give that, some of that in our classes and things and a lot of times where we're, where I think professors, including myself, I, I would say, are hung up is we need a lot of basic information to get out there. And so we may not be able to get as much critical thinking as we want in there, but when you add co-curricular activities, such as clubs, such as uh, service learning projects, when you add those all in with our education courses, then what we're trying to do in our classes, I think that's where things get, to, where a four-year degree is going to be much better than than no degree because of that critical thinking, because of the leadership and ability to, um, to uh, think outside the box, if you will. It does help open their mind to other things so that they can go outside, even if they decide horticulture is or is not for them when they get out, they can go to other areas and they're competent when they go because of the university education they have. So that, that is another bonus for going to the university. Many programs, either in, even in horticulture, want four-year degrees now uh, because of what that brings to the table for the students' in capabilities and abilities. The uh, success of our undergraduates, some have started nurseries, they work at nurseries, uh, some will own a nursery now. Um, unfortunately, uh, many students have the, the cows and plows attitude of here's ag, just in the mud all the time and, and it's low paying. And that's not the way it is at all. Uh, we have a lot of lab, a lot of work go on, goes on in laboratories. Um, we have a lot of work that requires, if it's not in a laboratory, it might be in the field, but it requires some very technical equipment, whether it's pH meters, soluble salt meters, uh, <clears throat> using a meter that'll tell how green a plant is very quickly. We are a lot of science. The jobs are there to pay, that do pay. I, uh, I enjoy the interaction with the students. They're a lot of fun. Um, I get paid to have fun at my job. I almost don't consider it a job. There's a lot of good things that happen with the students, with other faculty members as well. We have some, some very good, again, very good faculty here. Um, we really, I think, take uh, concern with our students and concern what happens to them now and after they graduate. Um, and so uh, the interaction with the students, and the students appreciate that, so you get a good appreciation as well.